Number of UK coronavirus deaths rise by 259 taking total to 1,028 Another 259 people have died in the UK after testing positive for coronavirus, taking the total to 1,028. The vast majority of those were in England where a further 246 deaths means a total of 935 people have died. NHS England said the victims were aged between 33 and 100, and all but 13 of them had underlying health conditions. Scotland has had seven more deaths, bringing the total to 40. There have been four more fatalities in Wales, bringing the total to 38. Northern Ireland has had 15 deaths after two more people who tested positive for the disease died. Spain's coronavirus death toll rises by 832 overnight to 5,690 Spain's coronavirus death toll rose by 832 cases overnight to 5,690, the health ministry said on Saturday, marking a new high in the daily rise in fatalities. The total number of those infected rose to 72,248 from 64,059 on Friday. U.S. cases exceed 100,000. Doctors decry scarcity of drugs and equipment. Doctors and nurses on the front lines of the U.S. coronavirus crisis pleaded on Friday for more protective gear and equipment to treat waves of patients expected to overwhelm hospitals as the number of known U.S. infections surpassed 100,000, with more than 1,500 dead. Physicians have called attention to a desperate need for additional ventilators, machines that help patients breathe and are widely needed for those suffering from COVID-19, the respiratory ailment caused by the highly contagious novel coronavirus. Iran unveils first mobile COVID-19 lab The first mobile coronavirus testing laboratory was unveiled in Iran on Saturday morning as the nation continues to mobilize all its capacities to fight off the novel coronavirus COVID-19, and the U.S. sanctions have forced the nation to indigenize many health and treatment systems and devices. The first mobile diagnosing laboratory was unveiled with the head of Besiege Popular Mobilization Organization Brigadier General Golam Reza Soleimani in attendance. The lab is also capable of diagnosing other viruses as well. The siege organization has also produced over 40 million face masks amid the national campaign against coronavirus epidemic. Iran death toll rises by 139 to 2,517 In last 24 hours Iran's death toll from the coronavirus outbreak rose to 2,517 on Saturday, with 139 fatalities in the past 24 hours, Health Ministry spokesman Kyanushe Jahanpour said. The total number of cases diagnosed rose by 3,076 to 35,408, he said on state TV, adding that 3,206 were in a critical condition. President Hassan Rouhani earlier reassured the public that the country, one of the most affected by the pandemic, has a strong healthcare system able to cope should there be a rapid progression of the disease. In comments broadcast on state TV, he said his government has allocated 20% of the budget to fighting the outbreak.